Hello everyone, this is Robert and today's lesson is uploading files to the web server. When I say files, I mean PDF files. And the reason you would load PDF files is maybe you have an inspection agreement or a sample report or some type of document that you want people to see. Um, and we're going to do this in three different ways. I'm going to show you one, um, how to do it with the editing environment, two, how to do it with cPanel, and three, how to do it using an FTP client. And uh, if you don't know what FTP clients are, you're about to see it, and you'll probably love using an FTP uh, client, especially since it's free. Uh, and, but we'll get to that in just a second. And the other thing I want to do is show you how to actually display your PDF documents on your web page. So instead of just having a link that says click here for inspection agreement, you people can actually see the inspection agreement. Uh, you know, instead of instead of uh, click here to download our sample report uh, people can actually see the sample report and this is why that's important if people are walking around with smartphones and tablets and about ninety percent of the population is and they go to your website they don't want to see a link to a document uh, first of all a lot of people are afraid to download anything and a lot of people really don't want to download a document to their smartphone and then have to open it back up with a PDF viewer that they have to download and install. So it's easier if they can just see the document already embedded in your page and scroll up and down and, and go through it and interact with it that way. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to uh, load these three files here. Uh, 01 is going to uh, be loaded through the editing environment. 02 is going to be loaded through cPanel. And 03 is going to be loaded through um, an FTP client. Okay, so since we're talking about inspection agreements and documents, let's go to um, the About page and Agreement. Now, it does not matter which of our platforms you use. The techniques I'm showing you apply to all of our platforms. Every uh, editing environment's the same. Every cPanel is the same and FTP clients are FTP clients. I mean, they might look a little bit different and, and function a little bit differently, but all FTP clients, FTP stands for File Transfer Pro Protocol, and it's a piece of software that allows you to transfer um, uh, files and documents and images from your local computer or your PC, your desktop computer, over to your web server uh, using drag and drop. You're going to love it. Once you see it, you're going to love it. If you've never used it before, uh, I think you'll want to start using it. But okay, so we're here on the agreement page, and this right here is the Google version of a docu uh, document viewer. It is the simplest thing that you could possibly put in your page. It doesn't require any technical knowledge whatsoever. It's free to use. Uh, you can adjust the width and height by simply changing some numbers once you install it but it's already pre-installed in your inspection agreement page and uh, also your sample report page and you'll see that in a minute but first what we're going to do is go to the editing environment so log into your editing environment and we're going to open up main content and go to the agreement page okay once we're here um, what we need to do is upload that actual document. Now all documents, all PDF documents and Word documents are uploaded by default to a directory called files. Some people call it a folder. Uh, but it's a directory called files, just like all images, uh, whether they're PNG, uh, GIF images, JPEGs, whatever. If you use the editing environment, um, images will be uploaded by default to the images directory so PDF and Word documents are uploaded by default to the files directory okay so what we want to do is just put our cursor somewhere and then click right here insert edit link now there is no upload button so you kinda have to go a roundabout way to doing it but it's not hard it's just a little weird and then once you click on that, click Upload, choose File, there it is, 01, Open, Send to Server. 
Okay. Apparently I already had a copy of that file on the server. So I am going to remove it. All right, and then we're going to start over here. Open and success. All right, just hit OK. Or actually, before you do that, you want to see if it's actually uploaded. So you can hit Browse Server. And there you go. This is your server view. And there's that file right there. I just uploaded it to the server. Okay, so close. And click OK. Now, you notice that the editing environment just inserted the file path right here. That's fine. Just delete it. Okay, so that was uh, how to upload a file using the editing environment. Now what we're going to do is upload this file right here, number two, and we're going to do it through cPanel. So open up cPanel, and then you have to go to File Manager, All right, and I'm going to go to the directory where I have that file. Okay, this right here is a server view. Once again, you're looking at the server. This is not my local computer. So I want to go to the direct, but what you're seeing is actually a mirror of what I have on my desktop. So I have all these files on my desktop. So I know that on my desktop, those files are located in the files directory. OK. <clears throat> and remember, this right here is the server. This is the web server. But I want to go to the directory on the web server where I want to load my file. OK. So I go to Upload, Choose File. There it is, number two, open, and it says complete. And then I just want to go back. There it is. That was really, really easy. As a matter of fact, let's do it again. I'm going to delete it from the server. It, no, I'm actually going to delete both of these from the server. So delete, delete, okay, upload, choose file. I think I can choose, nope, can't choose both at the same time. So I'm going to upload one again, complete, click here, then I'm going to upload two. As a matter of fact, I'm going to uh, cancel that. And remember what I said earlier. If you're using cPanel, you can upload files anywhere. So let's not load it in files. Let's go up one level. And let's actually create a new folder. And we'll call this folder uh, PDF. So I'll create a new folder called PDF and there it is. Double click to open and then upload. I want file 2, open, complete. There it is. It's on the server. Okay, and the third and final way I'm going to show you how to upload a PDF file is by using an FTP client. And this is what an FTP client looks like. This is my desktop. This is the web server. That's all there is to it. Now remember, 
over here when I clicked upload to choose a file and it shows me my local directory my desktop right here notice it's identical that's because this is exactly this is the same view it's a it, it's a two different ways of looking at the same folder okay so we cancel out of that and we're back in the FTP client right here now you know all those steps it took to upload a file right using uh, the editing environment or using cPanel's file manager there were steps this is what it's like using FTP I want to upload file number three to my files directory for my website done that's all there is to it I hope you enjoyed this lesson happy inspecting